Let's do another customs. What's my extract streak this patch? 39, I think? Or 37? I really don't understand why the people in the community target you. Sure, you do nutty things, but I personally don't see how you could avoid a ban for this long. <laughs> That's why the B battle state supporting streamer conspiracy comes in. That every single streamer is allowed to use cheats and is backed up by battle state. I don't know, man. <laughs> Lake. I don't know what to tell you, man. Like, past the point that I'm that I will say I'm not cheating. There's like, there's nothing I can prove. I can put a a, a cam behind me to look at my monitors, but then people will say I have like silent aim. You know, press a button on my mouse and I'll aim at the person's head. So, like, how do you know? You don't. You know what I mean? It's like... To me, it's kind of harassment at this point. Like, you, there's no, like... There's rule on, like, Reddit, no witch hunting. But the mods on Reddit already, like, hate me that much. Even though, like, what I've done to them, you know? That they don't remove those posts. Like, I think it's sort of, like, hurt, obviously. Like, if we're talking livelihood like let's say if i was you know doing this like full time and like relied heavily on streaming and everything it's definitely hurting youtube and everything like it's an accusation nothing more it's a guess of a fucking bot that has 100 hours in this game that thinks like shroud's fucking cheating like bro If Shroudliv was cheating for this fucking 15 years, like, dude, I don't... You gotta be, like, the biggest mastermind of a streamer that... Or, like, a lot of streamers have to be biggest masterminds to be good at games and not get caught in any game. Like, for instance, that thing with, um... I don't know if anybody saw, like, somebody was trying to call me out on hacking in Modern Warfare when my gun pointed at the wall. I figured when that happened... That was when Modern Warfare first came out. In Modern Warfare, there's a mounting system. I didn't know how it worked, so I mounted on my, like, I put the button on my mouse, like the side mouse. So, like, when I was there, because I'm gripping the mouse pretty heavily, it's really easy for me to push that button. And, aside, okay, let's just put aside, let's say, excuses, quote unquote. I am. A thousand viewer streamer at most, especially at that time. Game just came out. I assume I already have cheats. Who in their like who in their right mind? Like how retarded do you have to be to go from a thousand viewers to two hundred viewers to just to an a very exa uh, um saturated game where there's like Dr. Disrespect everybody streaming. There's no growth for me there. There's no growth for me. Especially just, like, streaming, like, regular multiplayer getting, like, you know, sick kills in a game that, no, like, everybody's getting sick kills. Like, how retarded do you have to be to just start cheating in a brand new game? You have 200 viewers to impress, like, what do I possibly gain from it? To impress the 200 people that I already have? That I'm, like, good at every game I play? It just it doesn't make any sense. Like, I understand, okay, sure, like, Tarkov is a growing, you know, thing, and I was sort of relevant in this game at one point or another. Maybe it will help me out. But, like, just use your brain. It doesn't make any fucking sense. Like, call it excuses or anything, but it's just like, who, why, you know? Like, people don't understand, like, how streaming works maybe or whatever like people don't just watch like nutty players or people who make like nutty plays like past that I just don't know what to tell you somebody's ADS in here Like, 
why would you, like, risk your livelihood and whatever you've built just to, like, get banned one point and what, run away with money? <laughs> How long is that money gonna fucking last to you? It's like, you gotta fucking think. Well, I guess people that are on Reddit, they don't really think. That's not one of their abilities. Oh shit, I was trying to loot his leg. This doesn't make sense, you know. Like, I'm thinking about making a video explaining everything. But it's not really like explaining clip by clip to a person to just be like, well, you're trying to like, you know, what do you call it? Like, make an excuse? But make a clip for those who are genuinely interested, play by play. Like, why this or that particular thing has been done. Maybe it will make, like, give them a different perspective. Because everybody, because everybody plays differently. So it's different, like, you know, different mentalities, different approach. So, it could be useful to certain people. I mean, I guess it's a little late for the video. They'll be like, whoa, you had like two months to come up with it. I mean, whatever. I'll still do it, but I'm lazy as fuck, so I'll figure out when. <laughs> but you get the, like, the general picture of what I'm trying to say. Uh, I don't think I want his valance. Kind of ass. But yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. Why oh, you stop running vowels? I like kind of dog shit now. Oh, whatever is in there. Just like, Just like you stress video. <laughs> yeah, I, I had a stress resistance leveling video that I never uploaded. Oh my god, lol. I think that was five minutes. It's funny how you can just speak out of your mind and shit on everyone in the game at the same time. Like, that's the thing. I've been streaming for two and a half years. It's like, whenever you do anything, you just get used to it. You get used to talking. Like, obviously, at some points when it's, like, something intense, like, I make pauses or, like, you know, time to think or time to do something. You know, kill people and then go on. Whatever. It's like, it's repetitive things. I've been doing this for so long. Like, if, if you can't do things that, like, or how do I put it properly? Like, if you're doing something for two and a half years or three years, and you can't, like, get it to a high level, I mean, that's already, like, a you problem, you know? Like, you don't know how to properly learn, or you're just not as good as, like, adapting to things, or fucking, I don't want to say perfecting them, but getting used to it. Whatever you want to call it. That's on you. I was just there, like, no rationale in people, you know. Zero energy? Yeah, that's why I'm trying to dip out real quick. It's up to them. It's their mind. Like, I'm not trying to change it. I'm just trying to give you my perspective on the things. If there's, like, people that hate me for, like, cheating in here right now and listening to this, then maybe you got the point. Maybe you didn't. It's up to you. Maybe I'm just a fucking loser who sits in a basement all day and all he does is just plays this fucking game, so like... <laughs> what else do I have good, you know, what else am I good at? Nothing else, you know? Playing fucking WoW and playing this game. I think they all got banned for now. Yeah, but they can still listen. Like, I I'm bidding you my left fucking tooth that there's people purposefully sitting here just waiting, just waiting, like, for the moment till I get banned or something. You know, like, they come in every day, they hate me, but they s they still sit here. It's like people who, like, on YouTube comments, they're like, fuck you, cheater, but you still come into my YouTube video and give me a fucking ad money. You know what I mean? Like, 
some of them probably don't have ad block. You still giving me money. Like, what do you want? Like, you have a boner on me, but you're still like supporting my channel. Like, I'll just delete your comment or whatever. Like, I don't. I barely even fucking read YouTube anymore. And it's like you got nothing else going on in your life, and you want to ruin someone else's shit. Whatever, bro. That's that's your thing. You know what I mean? Like, that's all well, you're good in life. I'll speak to you, man. I mean, I think at, like, one point, like, I won't lie that I, you know, I envy streamers, like, what they do is, like, so easy playing games and this and that, but. I don't know, man. It just it, it goes like beyond that, really. It's a commitment. Like regardless, yes, it's got its own perks, but unless you're Shroud Doc or you know one of the like super top tier streamers, it's a big commitment, and it's a rocky one as well. It's not a. It's not an easy thing to do. Especially, like, when you start getting trolls, you start getting this or that. It depends on how it affects you. Like, to me, like, I care about it because, like, it's my image. Like, why it's getting tarnished. But I'm not, like, you know, going into depression because of it. Like, it got me pissed off at times. But it's not, like, you know. I want to go, like, jump off a bridge because of these idiots. Even though that's what they probably want. After 14 years in construction, I would like to get paid to set up my ass in game. We'll see again. If you don't approach it properly, sit on your ass is also going to be pretty bad for you. Like, I've noticed my health like deteriorating. I'm trying to like you know go outside. Like I do it every now and then, but I guess I'm like not super willed to do it. But it's had the same effects on like the health. You know, like my back is like a little hurting every now and then. And my neck's getting stiff, so if I don't start doing something about it, like, you know, I'm lazy as fuck, but it's having its effects. And then, like, sure, when you built your community to, like, 5,000 viewers you. on any game, you, know what? Fuck the haters. Be you the probably best made you. it. Almost all of us are here to support you, bro. But, like, what do you call it? But, like, if you're a thousand two thousand viewers you're only halfway in like you're not you know you have to really commit to it like taking comparison let's say i mean it's a like it's a very big comparison but what i'm trying to say shroud took pretty much exactly the amount of time i took for my break the man's like revolved around hype and he's just popular in general. He comes back like 30k subs instantly, you know what I mean? Like He's worked for all that. He streamed constantly. He streamed for all the time. He committed, right? He was also there at the right time for the right games. Like it's different level of accomplishment. Like I come back and I don't even have like half or one third the viewers of what I had like let's say two months ago and that's just like the viewer retention like some people retain it better because you know like I'm just known for Tarkov other people they uh you know he's on another low so that's what I'm saying like if you're trying to start streaming if you develop up until this level like you still you still have so much to go through you're only really like 
can consider streaming reliable if you're in five to ten thousand viewers. Assuming if you want to take breaks or whatnot and you don't get banned. Like from streaming, kinda like Doc Omegalo. But if you think about it, there's like millions of people streaming that have one viewer and then like even having a hundred viewers, you're already in like top one percentile. Like it's crazy to think about it, but it it really is nothing if you're talking like monetary value. Depends obviously community to community, but you get the picture. Phoenix, thank you for the three dollars. Dion, thank you for the six months. Uh, Sedality, thank you for the three dollars support. But I can explain the Shoreline Bush clip from a year ago. That was like two years ago, and the clip is 720p in the shittiest quality. Because when I streamed, that was that DVL Bush clip was me streaming for my second or like third months. Well, I had my old PC where I was streaming on still from CPU on my 7700K with like 4000 bitrate. Take into account that it's 4000 bitrate. Take into account the Twitch compression. Take into account the compression applied on top of that Twitch clip because the clip is, I don't think it's no longer available, but it's on like YouTube compression. You get dog shit quality that you can't see. Like I spotted, I don't fucking know, like. Wouldn't, wouldn't want to lie about the color, but I spotted that the bush was, like, looking different. Like, the pattern of the bush was, like, green, 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 and then there's, like, either it was, like, super dark black or whatever. Or I think he had a scab backpack, maybe, on him. Whatever. And got lucky. Like, that's all it is to say. And again, it's, like... If for people that think that streamers get covered by like battle state at that time i had like fucking 30 viewers what battle state would deal with me like i'm no one to them i don't bring anything i don't bring in new people because i don't have my own community i'm not like i'm not an asset to them like only covering me is just like it doesn't make sense oh for fuck's sake It's just like things people don't understand, like simple image compression. Like that has an effect. Because some people say they do see it, some people say they don't see it. But imagine on my monitor, like at that time I think I had an Acer, Acer 1080p, so it's not like this 27 inch that I have right now, like more detailed and everything. But still, I'm up close to my monitor, like. Is that a rock? That's a rock. Oh sh Oh my god. I heard a guy running, but I thought that a rock was a person. Oh I had desynced a little bit. You are around the corner? Yeah, but it's Tarkov. Didn't hear him go to the right. Like that, I don't know. But the subs kind of disappeared. Well, but some people will say there is a guy behind the rock hiding there, and I ain't aim locked onto him. You know, like. <sighs> Man, it's just it's what it is. That is my perspective. On all this thing, clip it, whatever, send it to Reddit. Maybe there's people who listen, maybe there isn't. But, I mean, I just would really not like to be harassed. But I guess it's not like you can really... What monitor am I using? I have an Asus, uh, fucking... Uh, I don't remember the... It's like down below at the stream stream uh, description. Where it's generally a toxic place. No, I, I understand. Like, yeah, Reddit's likes to shit and everything, but
it's not like specifically Reddit that I'm talking about. It's like you know, imagine you're watching like a YouTube video of mine, right? And then you go into the comment section, all it's filled is like people accusing me of cheats, and then that person links to a video of a guy comparing me to Shroud, saying that Shroud's hacking and I'm using the same cheats as him, and like makes relevant like connections to like other games or whatever. Or like other streamers. And then they start believing it because well that old checks out, you know, I've I've always thought this guy was sus because like, you know, his plays are like they seem like way too fucking good. Like who nobody in their right mind who would put like fucking you know, tens of thousands of hours in the game would be still that good. Like again, you, you gotta be a cheating mastermind to like that death specific what I turn off cheats or something like I gotta be a mastermind to can to make people believe that I'm not you know or not slip up gotta be the most precise person in the fucking world <sighs> I'm not like pissed off I'm just, like, trying to make people see reason. But... I guess it is what it is, right? Are you always running just for nades? Depends if I have spare nades, like, extra. Not in here, I'll grab. Imagine all cheaters have your movement. Yeah, like, I mean, I don't want to say my, like, I don't want to, like, you know, fucking be, like, what's the word for it? Like a show-off, telling everybody that my movement's good. But I wouldn't say it's bad. Like, I can do some movement shit that a lot of people can't. You know, like, closing doors without barely ever stopping. Like, you know, doing it in a very, like, fl like having a flow, like a rhythm to my movement. Like, sure, I fuck it up, like, every now and then, like, I'll fuck up a jump, I'll fuck this and that. But, like, the flow of the movement, like, it's it's not like a bot fucking playing around scripting, you know? Every single movement with, like, a percentile error, like, hey, you will have 10% error, so, like, you will fuck up this jump or that jump. I mean, I guess I just perfected movement and everything else is just, you know, soft, whatever. Like you get you get the picture. Like it's still something I put a lot of time into because I knew pretty much from the movement that I started playing this game is from the moment that I started playing this game is that movement in this game, as clunky as that may be at the first like sight, it's actually very rewarding if you play it right. It could be extremely, extremely rewarding. It's not just about like whatever aim, game sense, everything. If every Counter Strike player that was extremely good at aiming would win, would win fucking <clears throat> what's it called? Uh, majors, Shroud would win one. But hey, <coughs> <coughs> sorry. Just the meme, sorry. But you get the... Does RPK treat you well? Feels like shit to me? It's alright. Gonna get 60 hits and no kill? Yeah, I know. It's fun. I like this one. RK RPK is the beam. How can it feel like shit? Oh, the damage on it's kinda ass. Watch it, please. Nah, I don't wanna watch it right now. 
you'll feel better. No, I feel good. Like I like <laughs> again, that's what I was saying about the camera. Like people don't know like you know how I feel because they don't see me. I feel I feel good. I'm just trying to like explain. 